Hey there, YouTube. Yeah, just catching the morning news here on uh, my ABC5. I'm not a mainstream media follower, uh, uh, but I am looking to see who won those elections last night. But I wanted to bring this uh, to your attention. Uh, a blackout alert. Uh, it always seems like things happen while they are doing drills. I'm out here on our local side here, KCCI 8, okay, so I'm not out on uh, Before It's News and reporting something out there on that site, um, it, which is a great place to go for some uh, uh, alternative news sources, so uh, to stay in the know, but um, this is just off of our local website, Iowa Utilities to Join National Blackout Drill. And I'll just go ahead and read it for you right quick. Um, Iowa's largest electric utilities will participate next week in a national blackout drill. This is next week, on Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. Mid-American Energy and Alliant Energy confirmed they will be involved in Grid X2 on Tuesday and Wednesday. The drill is sponsored by the North American Electric Reliability Corp. The nonprofit entity's mission is to ensure the reliability of the bulk power system in North America. The drill will include a simulated and prolonged blackout and will involve thousands of utility workers, business executives, anti-terrorism experts, and government officials from the United States, Canada, and Mexico. Can anybody say SSP? Google that one. Uh, North American Union. Uh, anybody want to Google that one? And uh, now they're going to hold a uh, international or joint drill next week on Tuesday and Wednesday. And given the activity on the sun lately of X flares popping off, and you know, I hear some people trying to minimize that, but you know, that is a genuine threat to Earth is us losing our electrical grids. And so I believe that, you know, with all these drillings that are going, the earthquake drills, the blackout drills, you know, uh, you know, and stop, stop and roll, you know, I don't know. You got all this stuff, that's, all these drills that are going on. They were even drilling during the Boston bombing, okay? They were drilling during 9-11. Uh, so, uh, you know, but this is something to pay attention to, folks. Mid-American spokesman Julie White described Grid X2 as a tabletop exercise. Alliance spokesman Justin Foss said the drill would not affect Iowa's electrical customers. That's for Alliant Energy. I wonder if it'll affect any Mid-American Energy customers. Or, you know, this is a national drill, though. This is not just happening uh, here in uh, Iowa. So, uh, will there be blackouts uh, next week uh, somewhere in the nation uh, during this drill? I think it would be a, a wise of us to uh, keep a lookout on that. Uh, but yeah, uh, next week, Tuesday and Wednesday, is the drill. And uh, it will you know, include thousands of uh, utility workers, thousands of business executives, thousands of anti-terrorism <laughs> experts, thousands of government officials, U.S., Canada, and Mexico. All right, and I really don't want Canada to know about our infrastructure or Mexico for that matter. And uh, I know we have uh, energy uh, contracts with them, and uh, you know we have to have the free flow of, of business and, and, and all that. But we're talking about the linkage of government and and uh, corporatism. And uh, you know, whenever they get involved in this stuff, you can depend on your grids going down. <laughs> and stuff to happen so uh, you know Fukushima is a good example but blackout alert guys look out for next week uh, is there gonna be some new sunspots gonna rotate into view uh, you got 1890 that still be uh, probably rotating off by that time but uh, more to come you know and Iowa will be part of this national drill so take care folks see what happens next week